Okay, so this will be a very quick one. It's just that uh, if you are like me, sometimes you teach the same class or you need to do a template and you want to have that into different folders of your classroom. And then most people would do is just like, oh, if you go in here and you just like this and you just say, make a copy or share, like you can right click on it. Whoops, right click on it and just say, make a copy. You can do that. But the only thing is just that if you make a copy, they are two separate. So if you change one, it doesn't change the other. So how do you have one file exist into two different folders? And when you do edit one, it does edit the other one. So simply go into your computer, any PCs or Mac, shift Z onto the actual selected folder or file, and then you have access to your drive. So just an example of this. So if I go to my classroom, this would be looking to photo 20. And this will be daily agenda. Move that there. Press OK. So if I go in here, I'll open that up. Just for an example, I'll go back. And in this case, I'll open to my, hopefully it's being photo 20, daily agenda. And then you have this one over here. So as you can see right on top, I have the two. But if I go into the first one, and I'm just going to put like something 20, and press Enter. Let it save, go back here. You can see now it's changed. So if I go back here, okay, so you see now it's the same thing. If I press on to control Z, it removed it, let it save. Now, if you go back to the other one, you have this. So therefore, what you do is very simple. Click on the actual file selected. Don't double click onto that, shift Z, and then you have all those options. So hopefully that's a pretty good and useful tip.